What? About what? Where are you going? We are going to Richard's house, who I haven't met yet. And he has a... We have a lot. Yes, it's good. And he has a bird on his window, a bird imprint. But we don't know yet if it's an owl or a pigeon. Because in the photo he sent, he only showed the bottom half of the bird. And he thinks it's a pigeon, I think. My suspicion is that it's an owl because of the way that the body is printed. Can you show me the photo? What makes you can't really see the head, but what makes me think it's an owl is that it's a full body print. And normally, when an owl flies into a window, it sees itself for the last minute, so it's flying. And then owls fly into double glazing because it's very reflective at night. So it sees a reflection of the garden, and then at the last minute, it sees itself, and then it tries to stop, it pulls back, and then you get the full body. Like this. Whereas if it's a pigeon, normally you get the head and the wings because they see through a building and think they can fly straight through. So they just so you get just the top of the head and the top of the wings. But we don't know until we see what's going on with the head. Really, the size could be either. You will see him on you. We will see him. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, 6.02. Okay. We can start. Go. Great. Great. <laughs> I just want to get a good spread of exposure. Amazing. Yes, do this. Perfect. 